But if you see somebody that doesn't have very good digestion, what do you do? I mean, there's a lot of different reasons that they might not have it, but what are some of the steps that people can take to, to try to turn that tide? When you want to address digestive issues, you want to address them at the level of the digestion and the level of the relationship between the digestion and the whole person. And you also want to look at the digestion as a whole, not just to focus on the large intestine or small intestine. Mm -hmm. So there are, you just basically go with the different stations. Do you have a good level of digestive enzymes? Is your acidity in the stomach good enough? Do you need hydrochloric acid? Do you need digestive enzymes? Then are you absorbing your food well enough? And part of it is heating habits that I can touch in a moment. And then are you eliminating well enough? Is you, are your bowels working well enough? Is, is your bacterial flora in the gut good enough? So using digestive enzyme, probiotics, botanical herbs. One thing that I developed based on the theory is a very, a very a combination that addresses all of this in the same time, drawn from Tibetan medicine, Ayurvedic medicine. And the wisdom behind it, when you give digestive enzymes, you are helping the digestion, but you're making the innate digestion healthy, uh, lazy. It's not working. It's not trying hard. And one of the issues that, you, that we talked also when we talked about mood and digestion is the general vitality. And we call it the fire of the digestion, the basic metabolic rate. There are certain herbs, especially spices. Mm -hmm. uh, it's interesting, it's a little bit of a diversion, but we now, one of the most amazing things is spices are the most powerful botanicals in medicine. Curcumin, ginger, mm -hmm. pepper, right? I mean, so much research on them for cancer, for cardiovascular, garlic, no, the basic spices. Yeah. What do they do? They move and warm the digestion, right? They get a sense mm -hmm. of heat. So if you put them in the right herbal formulas, you get the digestion to start working. Then your pH balances naturally. You get enough acidity okay. in the stomach, you get enough digestion. But there are some issues. What happens when you have fire? Heat rises up. And when heat rises up, we can get some reflux, mm -hmm. get some burning in the stomach and the esophagus, GERD basically. So in the same time, you have to put some herbs that will move the energy downward, so you have normal bowel movement. So if you address the normal peristalsis of the gut, you address the, the right pH of the stomach, right digestive enzymes and power of the small intestine, physically, and you can also address it emotionally and mentally, you can improve the digestion. It takes time to improve digestion, but it is possible.